Alright, today I'm going to be showing you how to shoot from, well, right now the rocket, um, in Greenfoot. As you can see here, it's just kind of a demonstration. This is what it's going to look like in the end. And I will show you how to do it. Okay, so you got to get your background and whatever you're shooting from and your bullet, obviously. So the coding in the bullet is just going to be set location, get X, get Y, and then get X, you're going to want plus 5 beside it for you want it to go to the right so much distance. So I'm going to make it 5 speed. You can make it whatever speed you want, or you can alter it, whatever. Afterwards, I will put all the coding into a uh, into the description to make it easier for you. Okay, so for the rocket, what you want to do is, in order to make it so when you press space, you want it to fire, here are the codes for when you move, like, see, I can move, it's when you press a certain key, and you get it to move, the same, same type of thing that we did with the bullet there, and moves it around, so we're going to do that, same type of coding except using space and we're gonna make a new bullet appear and we're gonna put get world dot add object because you can't add an object from another object you gotta get world and then just put get x and get y you know typical and you don't really need to put plus eighteen minus two that's just so I can make it appear at the front of the ship that's to kinda modify where it appears And once again, I will be putting these things in the description, because I'm not very good at this, but that should hopefully help you out, and I'll label which is for what. Okay, so if you wanted to make it so that whatever it is shoots vertically, I'm going to show you how to do that, because you'd have to ro rotate it, unless you're already facing vertically. Then you're going to have to make your coding, instead of get x plus 5, it would be get y plus 5, and your bullet would have to be facing up along with your ship. If your images are already facing to the side, I'm going to show you how to change that. So, here you can see it's a lot different. You have to go to your background, your world. Uh, mine is called background, and you have to identify the object. There you can see it's rocket R1, and here it identifies R1. And that's the coding you need to rotate it. And it's instead of the normal add object code, when you. Um, initiate the world this is the new add object code you'll use and as you can see there is the um, add object r1 and it shows the location on my thing where I want it to appear and then the rotation 270 degrees okay so the bullet um, this one's already facing up normally you would do the same thing with the identification of the rocket except instead of being r1 you'd have like b1 for bullet but this one, but this bullet is already facing up. I just put it into paint and rotated it. I'm sure you know how to do that. And so yeah, that's how you can do that. And once again, this is what you put for the bullet. Um, set location, get X, make it move forward automatically. It, it's not automatically appearing. Once you press space, and it appears, and then it's going to automatically start moving. I don't know what this thing is popping up, but. Uh, yeah, so then when you press space and you put all this stuff in, it should be good. I'll have it all in the description. I'm not very good at tutorials, but hope this tutorial helped you and have fun with your green foot shooting.